time, y'all. Hope everyone's been doing good. Tonight, going to do a quick shave. Hopefully get it done tonight with Uncle John's. I don't know where we shave. And Mont Blanc. Individual. They are a fresh linen scent. <laughs> kind of complement each other. Uh, the cologne's just a little bit on the brighter side than the soap. Let's see. Where's the ingredients on the soap? If you want to pose it, pose it. Uh, and once again, we'll be going with the above the tie SE1. I have the blade in there, what, fifth, sixth use, something like that. So, the brush. The brush is going to be the Zenith Boar. Still getting used to the brush. Breaking in the brush. So we will see how this goes. How was everyone's weekend? That's a lazy bum. <laughs> uh, as you can see a lot more, I should have squoze the water out a lot more. Because I typically face lather but with this brush still breaking in, I am bowl lathering. I don't know. Do, do they break in more quicker? More quick, quicker? <laughs> or do they break in quicker when you bowl lather or when you face lather? I don't know. I just figure that the bowl is a little bit stiffer than my face. Of course, I could be wrong with that. As you can see, got it all over the place. That's why you wear a shirt while you're wet shaving. But I'm not even going to go to the bowl. Someone had said part of the fun with breaking in a boar brush is face lathering and feeling it get softer and softer and softer. I'm going to add a little bit of water. As you can see, good thick lather. I heard a couple people say that don't really believe in cushion in a leather. I can agree and I can disagree. If you're using if you're using stuff that falls, if you're using something like a straight camisori, something without a guard on it. Yeah, you're not going to feel too much cushion. If you're using something that fell, I'm going to show you something that everybody's going to go. <gasps> if you're using a disposable, you would never be able to get to the hair on a disposable like that. All right, this is going to be fun. <laughs> I said, this is one of my favorite soaps. It's just so interesting, clean. I don't see a lot of people using it, even though it's Fantabulous. 
That's a shout out to Golden Rib. Used to enjoy watching his videos. <laughs> Kenny had a great sense of humor. Kenny still has a great sense of humor. Look, I got my hairs cut. Are oh, you proud of me? Decent first pass. Soap was a lot thicker than what it needed to be. But like I said, I am learning this brush. I'm going to add some water to it, so... Did I get myself? Nope. Not yet, at least, right? That's what you all are here for. You're here for the blood, not here for the entertainment. I need to start covering the stash up again when I shave. I did that for a while. I enjoyed it. Actually, I found a benefit to it. Kind of softened up the, the bristles. Made it more manageable. Because here lately, my mustache has kind of been like this. Going everywhere. Going everywhere but where it shouldn't go. Kind of like trying to herd cats. It's an old country saying. What country? I don't know. <laughs> so what's what you call cushion right there? Wow. You're just thick. Thick and pasty. <laughs> Comment going through my mind. I was gonna say thick and pasty, just like my first girl. Right? <laughs> I couldn't resist. I would have regretted if I hadn't said it. I'm going to wet my whole face down. You're like, what the hell, Jim? <laughs> Water. I'm going to go for a quick third pass. Of course, nothing's been quick here tonight, has it? It's everybody's plans for Halloween. I started a post in the It's Just Shaving Facebook group about what soap to use on Halloween. 
If you're not a part of that group, you need to be a part of that group. We have a lot of fun on that group. Speaking of that group, one of my favorite, sorry, fun shaving soap scents, also by Uncle John, was an exclusive of that group called It's Just Cake. It's a chocolate cake. Oh, yeah, and it is good stuff. I should have used that for my birthday shave. I don't think I really did a birthday shave. My birthday was uh, about a week and a half ago. And I want to thank everybody that wished me a happy birthday on Facebook. Hopefully I got to everybody replied. I'm kind of funny on the Facebook thing. I don't think you can write on my wall or do anything like that. I'm going to get cleaned up. I'll be right back. Hello. Again. Quick little recap. Seeing this bore brush. Still breaking it in. More than likely, it'll be a steady roll, I don't know, of bore brushes on this channel, at least till the end of the year. Uncle John's. I don't always shave. Uh, total loss. Above the tie, SE1 with a feather professional blade. We'll have to really clean it up because that soap, like I said, was thick and pasty. Uh, we will finish out with Mont Blanc. Individual. Mixed in with some Aqua Velva 5 in 1, so it's Gems Special 6 in 1. And remember, it's yay much. That is a unit of measure. Yay. Don't believe me? Check it out. About five sprays in with it. Blend it together. Off. You're about to hear my sink burp. So it's not me making any noises, it's my sink. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There it goes. <laughs> All right, everyone. Be good, be kind. Don't break your bottle of cologne. Oh, about the cologne. You can get it for about 30 bucks. Uh, fragrance net fragrance X and yeah see it didn't break well worth it if you ask me it's a good all around uh, spring fall it could be a little bit heavy in the summer and too light in the winter if you ask me but anyway be good, be kind, be nice to each other. Don't be a pain in my butt. And until next time, Jim's out.